Where's my roster at? I'm working on it, all right. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome. Did you find my roster yet, Clint? I'm still working on it. Give me a, <laughs> cut me some slack. Welcome to Paul Post Field House. Senior night here tonight. Sell us all black diamonds versus the spiral bulldogs. Big girls matchup tonight for the lady diamonds. Trying to pick up just another win. Got districts coming up next week. We got a string of road games coming up, I think, tomorrow night and then Tuesday. Tomorrow night, I think we go somewhere. No, maybe not. I'm really not sure. I haven't seen a schedule lately, but we got a bunch of road games coming up, that's all I know. I think we're ready for the national anthem. Are you gonna sing it tonight? Well, I was, but did you get bumped? Yeah. Uh, it happens. It to does. The best of the talent. Yeah, it does. Everyone, stay tuned for the national anthem.
All right, Clint, we're ready for the starting lineups. We got the notorious Mike down there again tonight on the camera, on the baseline. We got Dennis upstairs. We're pretty much set then, aren't we? Good to go. Yeah. Hear that? Don't miss it. You see that one cheerleader Thursday. doing backflips all the way off the court? No, I didn't. I can do that. Can you? Yeah. I don't believe you. I just choose not to. <laughs> Clint, we're ready for tip off. It's just enough knowing that you can do it. Yeah. That's it. Yeah, that's, that's all I need. Senior number 13, Heather McCauley, getting the start tonight for the Lady Diamonds. Glad to see that. I think she's going to come in here with a three-point barrage tonight. I know. I'd like. I'd like. She's one of those two. If she really gets, she gets off to a good start, man, she's going to light them up. Number 25, Miller, to jump for the Lady Bulldogs. Looks like Sarah Snyder is going to win the tip. Covington with the ball. Two-one-two. Two look here by the Lady Bulldogs. Pass inside to Snyder. Inside to Smith. Smith with a shot. It's off. Rebounded by Snyder. Snyder with the put back inside. Lady Diamonds in a little, little full court press here. Good job by Snyder to flick the ball out of bounds. What do you know about the Lady Bulldogs? Not much really. I really don't either. Number 22 right there with the, the ball handler, it's Phillips. Pass inside to Miller. Over to number three, that's Fouts. Number 20, that's Bowen. Over to Fouts, she looks inside for Miller. Miller back outside, shot on the way, shot's good for Bowen. So both, so both teams score on the first position of the ball game. Dags with the ball up top over to Covington, 4-3. It's going to be off the rim, rebounded long by Dags, pass inside to Snyder. She's going to be fouled before the shot. It's going to be on the ground. It's going to be Lady Diamond's ball out of bounds underneath. Who was that foul on, Clint? Did you see? No, I didn't. Our scoreboard operator failed to put it up there for us. That's the first team foul on the Lady Bulldogs. Over to Covington with the shot, just inside the three-point line, hits it. So the 17-footer is good. Got 
Gonna have a backcourt violation here on number 33. That's Jones. Good defense there by the Lady Diamonds, Clint. Yeah, good job forcing that turnover. Lady Diamonds basketball. Lady Bulldogs staying in the 1-2-1-2 one, two, one, two zone. Skip pass, Covington with another open shot. This is a three, it's off the back iron. Long rebound, brought down. Good hustle there by Daggs. It's gonna be out of bounds off the spiral Bulldogs. Lady Bulldogs, gonna be Lady Diamond ball. 5.56 left here in the first quarter. First quarter, Lady Diamond's up 4-2. Pass inside's deflected, loose ball. Daggs comes up with it. She's coming up with a lot of loose balls so far. Oh, just got robbed. Stolen away by Jones. Pass up the court, knocked out of bounds by Megan Smith. Ooh. Mike's gotta be careful over there. <laughs> I know it. We're gonna have to get somebody in there to protect him. We have to get him a bodyguard over there. Yeah. Maybe we gotta get Fulbright, see here? I don't know. If anybody could do it, he could though. Ball's gonna be knocked out of bounds off of Megan Smith. I saw our old buddy Riley Harrison. He'd, he'd step in there, protect him, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure you're right. Lady Bulldogs moving the ball around the perimeter. Not much patience there. Quick shot. Shot's off. Sarah Snyder comes up with the ball. Macaulay, 4-3, off the rim, rebound inside. Pretty good rebound there by number 33, Jones. She, she's a leaper. See that? I just saw her jump really high. Oh, okay. Good defense by the Lady Diamonds. Lady Diamonds getting some good looks on that backside skip pass. There it is again. Macaulay with the shot. Rims out on her. In and out. That's going to be there. I think that's going to be open all night against the zone, really. It seems like it. It has been so far. Lady Diamonds in this man to man defense. Pass inside to Miller. Double team on Miller. Outside, Jones going to take the jumper. Baseline jumper's good for Jones. We're all tied up here at four. Four minutes left. Dags with the three-pointer. Off the rim. Rebound by Miller inside. Ball's gonna be off of number three, Fouts. Out of bounds. Substitution here, looks like Caitlin Hall checking into the ball game for Lindsey Daggs. That's not Dan Fouts either. It's not? No. I was I was really curious. I mean, you, were, you were looking at me kind of funny. Yeah. Lady Diamonds setting up the offense here. That pass is there again. Nice pass inside by Covington. Megan Smith with the deuce inside. Well, they're gonna they're gonna force Lady Bulldogs to have to make some adjustments here pretty quick on the defensive end. I don't know if they can cover us in a man-to-man. -man. Pass inside to Miller is good. Miller gets the two inside. No, they've not shown yet that they can. Collie inside to Snyder. Good pass again by Covington. Shots off, rebounded by Hall, backside, it's off. It's Megan Smith battling in there, loose ball. Miller comes up with it. Lady Bulldogs out on the run. A Rosco in the ball game for the Lady Bulldogs now, number 11. Is that like Jesse Orozco, the old Mets pitcher? No. Okay. <laughs> Completely different. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Pass over to Covington on the wing. Little trap out of this zone here. Leaves a wide open shot inside for Snyder. Good pass by Hall. Looks like we're gonna have a timeout. Lady Bulldogs, 228 left here in the first quarter. Lady Diamonds eight, Lady Bulldogs six. Tonight's game is being brought to you by the Blue Ribbon Auto Group. 
offering Chevrolet, Pontiac, GMC, Buick, Dodge, Chrysler, and Jeep products all right here in Salisaw. They'll beat any advertised price, guaranteed. Just give them a call or go see them south of I-40 on Highway 59. That's Blue Ribbon, Salisaw, home of the low-priced cars. Perry's Office Supply has been serving Sequoia County since 1978. They have everything you need to keep your office running efficiently. They've got it all from paper clips to computer supplies, even office furniture. Just go see Gus Perry down at 205 North Oak. You call, that's all. Hill Hall. I believe you. If you don't believe me, just give him a try and see. He'll, let me tell you, he'll be there. Lady Diamond showing a 2 2 1 press here. Phillips with the ball. Pretty good defense by the Lady Diamonds there to get back. Pass inside, that's number 12 in the ball game now. Blue Hills number 12, Stoughton. Pass inside the Smith, loose ball. We're gonna have a tie up here inside. Looks like it's gonna go to the, uh, it's gonna go to the Lady Bulldogs, Clint. up the floor. Shot on the way from Fouts. Got it. Shot on the way from McCauley. She got the two-pointer. Lady Diamond's dropping back. Looks like they're gonna drop back to their 1-3-1, one, one, Clint. Good defense there. Stolen away by Dags. Well, gonna have a walk here on McCauley. A little bit out of control. Just a little bit. Phillips with the ball at the point. Lady Diamonds in the 1-3-1. One, one. Ball's gonna be stolen away by Dags. Dags looks like she's gonna slow it down, back it out. Looks like they're gonna hold up for the last shot. I think you're right. See what they've been, Lady Diamonds been getting a lot of good open looks at the basket tonight. Yeah, they have. Pass inside to Smith. Shot and the foul. Nice shot by Megan Smith inside. Good pass by Caitlin Hall. Yeah. Lady Diamonds have shown some good, good crisp passing tonight. Looking good. We're going to need that in the playoffs. Yeah. Most well, certainly. We'll see how their free throw shooting is tonight. They didn't really didn't have a very good night shoot free from the free throw line last time. Lady Bulldogs don't have much time to get up the floor for a shot, and they're not hurrying either. I think she's going to pull up and shoot it. Roscoe, it's shot is short. Into the first quarter here. Lady Diamonds with a good quarter of play. Lady Diamonds 12, Lady Bulldogs 8. Most people don't know where to turn for help when families need it the most. Professional Home Health and Hospice offers a special kind of care. They understand the importance of meeting your care needs. Professional has an award-winning nursing staff and offers homemaker services. Their employees are carefully screened, including numerous state and federal background checks. If someone you know can benefit from their services, give them a call at 776-9400. Professional Home Health and Hospice, compassionate care you can trust. For more information, visit them on the web at professionalhomehealth.net. And because every little detail counts, you can count on Salisaw Lumber for quality building materials, including Valspar products and Anderson windows. Good results begin with a solid foundation. That requires the right materials for the job. 
That's why the pros and do-it-yourselfers trust Southsaw Lumber for selection and service. And in difficult times, it's comforting to know that you can rely on Agent Funeral Home and their 68 years of experience to help you and your family. Agent Funeral Home, personal service with distinction. Looks like it's going to be Lady Diamond basketball, 12 to 8 here, start the second quarter. Lady Diamond's moving the basketball, good pass inside to Snyder, Snyder with the two. Good well, pass by Hall. She's well, looks like it could be there all night for him. It's kind of frightening for the Lady Bulldogs. I can't do really anything about that. Could be rough times ahead for them. Still in the 1-3-1. Looks like McNamee's up at the point now for the Lady Diamonds. Shot on the way for Roscoe. It's off. Rebounded backside. Covington with the ball. Shot up inside, it's good for McNamee. Phillips with the ball. Lady Diamond staying in the 1-3-1. One, one. Roscoe with the shot from the baseline, way off. It looks kind of like a Clint Smith shot right there. Uh, <laughs> it was closer than that. Pass inside to Snyder, she's fouled. Looks like it's going to be on the ground. She's starting to become in unstoppable inside. A force. Pass inside the McNamee. Shot by McNamee is deflected. Daggs comes up with a loose ball. Backside of Dags, pass over to McNamee. McNamee shot inside, deflected, knocked away. It's going to be out of bounds. It's going to be off the Lady Bulldogs. Going to stay with the Lady Diamonds. Good hustle inside by Sarah Snyder. Sounds like Danny might be telling some jokes up there. People yeah, laughing. She's no joke teller. McNamee inside. She's going to walk. I think McNamee's forcing a little bit inside. She just needs to stay in the flow of the game. She'll be all right. Lady Diamond staying in the 1-3-1. One, one. Gonna have a trap here in the corner. Phillips tries to dribble out of it. Over to Jones. Back to Fouts. She foot was on the line. Good rebound inside by Jones. She's just an athlete inside. She's well, she's she, one of the better female athletes I've seen this year. She got some air on that rebound. She got way up there. Man. Miller with the ball. Over to Roscoe. That was good, Jesse Roscoe, the old pitcher for the Mets. That you was like good. That? that was good. Not many people knows about it, remembers him probably. He was on their old World Series team. That's right. Back in 86. Miller with the ball inside. The ball's deflected. Helter-skelter offense going on here for the Lady Bulldogs. Three-pointer on the way. It's off the back rim. It's going to be out of bounds. It's going to be Lady Diamond basketball. Clint, actually, Jones, number 33, she started for Northside last year. She's a really? Move, she's a move in, yeah. I'm sure they're glad to have her. I'm sure. She's got a 40-inch vertical. Shot on the way. Megan Smith gets the left-hand shot inside. Deflected by Smith. Stolen by Smith. Good defense there by Megan Smith. Well, Lady Diamond here with a chance to just bust it wide open. Looks like we're going to have a walk here on Covington. 
4.51 left here in the second quarter. Lady Diamonds up 18 to eight. Reminder, everybody, stay tuned with us at halftime. We're gonna bring you some jazz band. Yes, we are. I love me some jazz band. Pick number 20 now in the ball game for the Lady Bulldogs, that's Bowen. Another turnover. Lady Bulldogs having a tough time against this 1-3-1. Seems like their offense went was more smooth against the full court press. They yeah. could actually get something going. Yeah, get, a good shot, get a good shot out of it. Pass inside to Smith. Ball's deflected. Pass inside. Loose ball stolen away by Miller. She gets to the Bowen. Daggs comes up with it. Left-handed layup inside's off. Rebounded by Jones. Jones is going to bring it up. Man-to-man -man defense from the Lady Diamonds. Passes knocked away. Miller comes up with it inside. Shots up by Miller. Rebound by Snyder. Looks like it might have been deflected just a little bit by Snyder on that shot. Ball's going to be deflected. It's going to be out of bounds off the of Lady Bulldogs. It's going to be Lady Diamond ball. Looks like number 44, Candace McNamee, number three, Myra Salazar, number 13, Heather McCauley checking in for the Lady Diamonds. by the Lady Diamonds moving the ball around the perimeter. Lady Bulldogs staying in this zone here. 2-1-2. Two, two. Looks like they try to trap out of it, Clint, when the ball goes to the corner. Yeah. Covington for three. Got it. Got it. There it is. Pretty good job there by McCauley. To, she had the open shot, but she passed it up to Covington, who had a you know wide open jumper over there. Jones on the drive. Good defense there by Covington to come up and help out. Skip pass. Fouts for the three. Off the back iron. Rebounded by Bowen. Shots up and in for Bowen. Covington for three. Off the back iron, rebounded by Jones. Jones up the floor to Roscoe. Inside to Miller, Miller with the two. Lady Bulldogs trying to hang around. Lady Diamonds up 21-12. Looks to be the Lady Diamonds just really poured on them here at poor halftime and really pull that to a good lead. Pass to McCauley. McCauley with the jumper. It's going to be rebounded by Bowen. Shots off. Rebound by Miller. Shots up by Miller. It's off. Loose ball inside. Good job by McNamee to come up with it. We're going to have a jump. We're going to have a hold here. Looks like it's going to be on Fouts. Number three. Could be her. Looks like it's going to be her first foul. McNamee was getting kind of physical down under there. Both teams doing a pretty good job. Not, not too many fouls so far in the ball game. Only four team fouls on the Lady Bulldogs. Lady Diamonds only one team foul. So you can see some of that fine camera work from our old pal Mike under there. Pass inside, nice shot by Sarah Snyder. Lady Diamonds doing a good job in there. 1-3-1 zone here. Megan Smith at the point. Pass inside to Miller. Good job by the Lady Diamond defense. Just collapsing on her. 
three girls on her. Smith up the floor. She's going to be, looked like she was almost fouled, but she got the left hand land to go. Oh, Good nice job shot. by Megan Smith. Looks like we're going to have a violation here on the Lady Bulldogs. Looks like they may have stepped over the line. It's going to be Lady Diamond the ball underneath, the, underneath their own basket. Not a good situation for the Lady Bulldogs in the last minute of the half. It's not what you want. Good job by the Lady Diamonds executing here. Ball's going to be deflected out of bounds off the Lady Bulldogs. 38.1 left here in the quarter. Actually in the half. Remember at halftime we're going to have live performance from the jazz band. Snyder with the shot, off the back iron. Jones with the ball. She drives inside, shots up by Jones, off the back iron, rebounded by Hall. Nice steal there by Jones. Jones with the shot, it's off, rebounded by Phillips. Good defense by Hall down under there, preventing that shot. Pass inside to Jones. Jones with the layup, it's good. Lady Diamond's got one shot here. McCauley with the three. No good. So we go to halftime. Good half for the Lady Diamonds. Halftime here from Paul Post Fieldhouse. Lady Diamonds, 25. Lady Bulldogs, 14. We'll be right back after a few words from our sponsors. Thinking about the death of a loved one is difficult, but it's vital that we have frank discussions about end-of-life care. I want all Americans to know that they can have hospice care at home, in a nursing home, or a hospital. And for most, the cost is covered by insurance, Medicare, or Medicaid. My mother recently turned 101, and we've made sure that her wishes will be respected. Discuss it with your family. You'll be thankful you did.
Hello. Can anybody hear me out there? Hey, Bob's not here right now, but if he was, I'm sure he'd be reminding you. Hello. I seem to have locked myself in my dressing room. And if you're in the market for a new or used car, truck, van, or SUV... A little help here. ...and you want the lowest possible price on that vehicle... Well, that's... Oh, that's better. ...you need to come see us here at the home of the low price cars. That was the darndest thing. All right, uh, three, two, one. Hey! Blue Ribbon Salazar, home of the low price cars. Well, what do you mean the commercial's already over? At Shelter, we offer great insurance, great performance, and great agents. That way, people can concentrate on the really important parts of life. So while you're doing things like this, we manage to do this. And if you ever do something like this, it's good to know this. At Shelter, we take care of things so you can get on with your life. For auto, home, life, or business insurance, see Shelter agent George Glenn. $30,000. Do I hear $40,000? $40, Do I hear $50,000? $50, I have $50,000. Sold to the gentleman in the side. Uh, hi. Moving on. This is yeah. a 19... Okay. I want to go ahead and sell it now. Sell what? Um, that thing I bought. Constantly buying and selling stocks doesn't make much sense either. That's why Edward Jones advises clients to buy long-term investments. Edward Jones, making sense of investing. Home of the low price cars, Ray Hey, Bob. I just wanted to let you know that you're doing a really fantastic job. Well, thanks. I appreciate that. So anyway, as I was saying... When it comes to TV announcing, you're the top. I really appreciate that. Thank you very much. So like I was... Ooh, man, Bob. All right, all right. What's going on here? Hey, Bob. Hey, Bob. 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 Blue Ribbon Salazar. Home of the low price cars. Bob. Oh, there's some Bob. nice fellas there. Bob. My father spent his last teenage birthday in a rain of fire. I will not die here, he said to himself. Fifty years later, he whispered the same thing to me from the hospital bed. Hospice provides the end-of-life care you and your loved ones want and need. It's available to everyone. With the help of the people at our local hospice, they get his wish. And so do we. Hospice care. Comfort and compassion when it's needed most. Before you answer any questions about your insurance needs, doesn't it make sense to see the insurance company's report card first? Shelter Insurance looks like this. 
We're rated A for excellent by AM Best. Here's more good news. Nine out of 10 customers say they'd recommend us to someone else. An excellent rating and satisfied customers. Shelter Insurance. You can save when you insure both your home and auto with Shelter. See Agent George Glenn for details. Hey, Bob. Yeah, have you disinfected the area? Good. Now make a three-inch incision between the fourth and fifth abdominal muscles. Shouldn't you be doing this? It's really straightforward. Listen, I gotta go, Bob. I'll talk to you later. Making important financial decisions on your own doesn't make much sense either. That's why Edward Jones prefers meeting clients face-to-face. -face. Edward Jones, making sense of investing. Thinking about the death of a loved one is difficult, but it's vital that we have frank discussions about end-of-life care. I want all Americans to know that they can have hospice care at home, in a nursing home, or a hospital. And for most, the cost is covered by insurance, Medicare, or Medicaid. My mother recently turned 101, and we've made sure that her wishes will be respected. Discuss it with your family. You'll be thankful you did. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're back. Brad Cameron and Clint Smith live, Paul Post Fieldhouse, getting ready for the second half of play underway to, to, to get started. There you go. <laughs> Lady Diamonds up 25-14. Pretty good scoring here for Lady Diamonds. Sarah Snyder did a good job, and Megan Smith in the first half inside. Both have eight. Yeah, they, <clears throat> both, both of them are lead all scorers. Megan Smith giving uh, Sarah Snyder a run for her money on that dominant player she of the game. Tonight. Yeah. Snyder's gotten quite a few of them. Covington doing a pretty good job from the field. Also, she has five. McCauley with two. And it looks like Candace McNamee with two. These are unofficial scoring results. So oh, they, they're official. They could be false. They're <laughs> official. It's going to be Lady Bulldogs here. To Lady Bulldogs ball to start the second half of play. Phillips with the ball over to Fouts. Fouts with the jumper. Nice block shot there by McNamee. Ball's loose, out of bounds. There's Mike down there getting involved in the action. Is he mixing it up down there? He's getting there. <laughs> it's going to be Lady Diamond basketball out of bounds. There we go. Some crowd noise going on. We have looks like we're going to have a foul here, a block on number 20. It's going to be on uh, Bowen. It's going to be her second foul, I believe. Let's call it her first. <laughs> Tricks you, Clint. Nice backdoor pass by Covington. Shots off, though, by Daggs. Rebounded by Jones. She's on up the court by herself. One on three. She takes it to the bucket. She's going to draw the foul. It's going to be a block. Shot's going to count. Good job by Jones. Good athletic move. She's a, she's a good athlete. Yes, she is. Shot is going to count. Foul is going to be on, I believe, number 13, Heather McCauley. I believe you're right. Free throw by Jones is off the back iron. Rebounded by McCauley. Looks like McCauley might have banged up her elbow a little bit when she hit the deck. Covington on the wing. Another skip pass to Daggs. Couldn't handle it. Ball's going to be out of bounds off Daggs. It's going to be Lady Bulldog basketball. back in it here. No, we really don't. Just need to settle down and get back in their rhythm. Phillips over to Fouts. Trapped here by the Lady Diamonds. Almost a walk there. On Bowen. Good defense by the Lady Diamonds. Stolen away by McNamee. You know, first time I've seen McNamee play the point of the 1-3-1 zone, but she's doing a good job. Nice pass by Covington. Dags with the land. Good job by the Lady Diamonds right there executing the offense. 
Jones brings it up the floor for the Lady Bulldogs. Over to Phillips. We have a foul here. We're going to have a hole. It looks like it's going to be on Covington. Clint, we got a real treat in for the boys' game. we got Spirals boys coming in here tonight. They're, they're tough. I don't know how if that's going to be much of a treat for our boys' team. Really. Ranked in the top 10 in 3A basketball. Yeah. I think they're the only team that's beat Roland so far this year. I believe you're right. Vian got close. Speaking of Vian, yeah, speaking of Vian, Lawndale Taylor signed with OU today. Did or, he really? Actually, the other day, yeah. Yeah. So he's going to be going to OU. That's cool. Play receiver. Covington with the ball, top of the key. We like to keep everybody informed, don't we? Stolen like, away by Miller. We're like the Inquirer. Nice drive by Jones. Shots up, it's off. Rebounded. We're going to have a jump ball situation. That Jones is a good athlete. She certainly is. I wonder if she's a track athlete. If she is, I bet you she's pretty. If she's not, she certainly should be. Yeah. Two one two zone for the Lady Bulldogs. Covington on the wing. Over to Snyder. Covington 4-3. Got it. Three-pointer Ashley Covington. We need more of that. If they're gonna if Covington's gonna hit the three, they're gonna have to come out and guard her. That's gonna leave Snyder and Magnamy open inside. Right. Yeah. Make it easy for him to dump it down into Snyder. Jones inside with the shot. Good move by Jones there. Jones with the steal. Jones with the lay in. So but Jones thinking about single handedly bringing him back. He's putting on a show for us. Snyder on the baseline. Good pass inside. We're going to have a foul here on Fouts. He's going to send Candace McNamee to the line. To shoot a pair. At the 408 mark in the third quarter. Lady Diamonds up 30 to 20. Magnamy at the line. First shot by Magnamy's off the back iron. Second like number 21, Megan Smith, and number 31, Caitlin Hall checking in for the Lady Diamonds. Second shot on the way. Good rebound by Hall on the miss. Pass inside. Loose, just loose ball. Roscoe comes up with it. Up to Phillips. Phillips gonna back it out and set up the offense. Rebound by Covington. Pass inside to McNamee, shots up. McNamee's gonna be fouled. So McNamee is certain herself in the offense. She's just gotta, she's gotta hit some free throws here at the line. I bet they've been working on that quite a bit in practice. What do you think? I hope so. First shot by McNamee's off. McNamee gets the second one. Phillips up the floor quickly to Fouts. Miller inside with the shot. She's off. Rebound by Smith.
Nice backside pass there by Caitlin Hall. Shots good for Lindsey Daggs. Cough drops? No, I'm all right. Bouts with the three. Wow. They're trying to hang in there. Dags with the shot inside. It's off. Nice rebound in there by Magnamy with the putback. Good job by Candace McNamee in there, getting physical and aggressive. Yeah, she settled down a little bit. She's doing her thing now. Bouts with another three-point attempt. It's off. Long rebound. Nice, nice. play. Good play by Megan yeah. Smith. Great awareness. Throwing it off of a Roscoe. Sarah Snyder checking back into the game for Candace McNamee. Good job by Candace, though. Yeah, inside. great job relieving Snyder. Two one two zone by the Lady Bulldogs. Covington inside with a shot. It's off. Timeout, Salisaw. 142 left in the third quarter. Lady Diamonds, 35. Lady Bulldogs, 23. Picture a world where vacations become a reality. Grocery bills go down and meals cost less. Now picture yourself walking into First National Bank and opening a generation's gold account. Offering travel discounts, prescription discounts, free checks, and tons of other benefits. Generations Gold is a checking account like no other. Partnering with over 200 local businesses. Offering local discounts all around our community. It's only available from a bank like no other. First National Bank Salisaw, member FDIC. Tonight's game is also brought to you by Charlie's Chicken, where you can have an all-you-can-eat buffet seven days a week. They cater for all occasions. Call now to book your Valentine's dinner. Dine in or drive through. That's Charlie's Chicken. It's just like Mom's. 720 West Cherokee, 775-9816. Sounds like someone had an accident over there. <laughs> Somebody fell down, I think. Lady Diamond basketball here. Minute 42 left in the third. Looks like we're going to have a timeout in Spyro. Not another timeout. They couldn't figure out the play there. Timeout Spyro, 142 left in the third. Lady Diamonds, 35. Lady Bulldogs, 23. Scopus Law Office is a proud supporter and sponsor of Black Diamond basketball. Serving Sequoia County and Eastern Oklahoma since 1971, Scopus Law Offices has a strong tradition in law, just as the Black Diamonds have a strong tradition in basketball. Located at the corner of Creek and Elm, just west of the courthouse, the attorneys at the Scopus Law Offices are here to help you with all of your legal needs. To make an appointment, give them a call at 775-5546 or toll free at 888-775-5546. Lady Diamond's inbound the ball. Hall's going to walk. Lady Bulldog basketball. Nice steal there by Megan Smith. Smith with the left hand land. Good job by Megan Smith there. Stolen away by Caitlin Hall. Nice pass to Snyder with the jumper in the lane. Ball's off. Loose ball is brought down by Roscoe. She's going to travel. It's going to be Lady Diamond basketball. One two left here in the third quarter. is going to be deflected. Pretty good save there by Hall, but yeah, it was. 
Jones comes up with it. Miller inside. Ball's deflected, loose ball. Ball's on the floor, we're gonna have a jump ball situation here. It's gonna be Lady Bulldog basketball. 34.9 left here in the third quarter. Shots up, it's off. Rebounded by Dags. Jones comes up with the steal. Man, nice steal. Ball was deflected. Jones comes back up with it. Pass inside to Miller is off. Hall comes up with it. Shot by Hall off the backboard as we end the third quarter of play here. Lady Diamonds 37, Lady Bulldogs 23. Oasis Tanning is now under new ownership where you can have that sun-kissed look all year long with their 10-minute ultra bronze beds or their 20-minute customized beds. They also have all the tanning accessories that you'll need. Complete lines of your favorite tanning lotions, gels, and sprays. Oasis Tanning, located at 1160 Brown Boulevard. Give them a call at 775-4050 today to schedule your tanning sessions. Tonight's broadcast is also being brought to you by Diamond Net, your hometown high-speed connection to the world. Offering digital cable telephone service and the fastest internet access in town. All brought to you by the city of Salisaw. Tonight's game is being produced by the Sequoia County Times. Sequoia County Times, your local news and sports leader. Blue Ribbon Auto Group offers Chevrolet, Pontiac, GMC, Buick, Dodge, Chrysler, and Jeep products in Salisaw. They'll beat any advertised price guaranteed. Give them a call or go see them just south of I-40 on Highway 59. That's Blue Ribbon Salisaw. And you know they're the home of the low-priced cars. Lady Diamond basketball. Looks like the Lady Bulldogs staying in the zone, but looks like they're putting a little more pressure on the Lady Diamonds outside. Rising Hoover in the ball game now for the Lady Diamonds. Three-pointer on the way, it's off. Rebounded by Jones. Jones is gonna step on the line. She just gets the ball and takes off, and <laughs> she's fast. Anyone that can go with her, you know, yeah. is more than welcome to go. Over to Covington, on the wing. Pass backside to Ryzen Hoover, in and out of her hands. Covington zip that one across there. Pass inside, deflected by Miller. Mike Crawford there on the camera work. He keeps on, we might hire him on full time. It's a possibility. Pay your really not that good though. Backcourt violation on the Lady Diamonds. Lady Diamonds in the 1-3-1. Megan Smith at the point. Number 34 in the ball game now for the Lady Bulldogs. That's Stout with the shot. It's a Stout move inside. That was pretty good. Yeah. I'm getting better. It'll work in a pinch. A lot of practice. <laughs> yeah. Stout will go to the line. Shoot a couple. Powell was on Ashley Covington, her second. First shot's good. Third team foul on the Lady Diamonds. Not a lot of fouls tonight. No, the referees are really calling it pretty, pretty good. Oh, pretty good game. Second shot's off the rim, rebounded by Snyder. You like to see the referees let them let them play a little bit. Oh, I always like to see that. Covington on the drive. 
Lady Bulldogs in a man-to-man. -man. Covington for three, no one on her, off the back rim. We're gonna have an over-the-back call on Megan Smith. Pretty good block out there by number 25, Miller. Lady Bulldog basketball, Jones brings it down the floor. Ball's deflected away, stolen by Snyder. Megan Smith was all alone up the floor, but they didn't see her. Lady Diamonds will slow it down. Covington inside to Snyder. Snyder with the shot. It's off. Rebounded by Miller. We're going to have an over the back call on Snyder. Lady, Lady Diamonds getting good looks inside. They just got to finish them. Looks like Caitlin Hall and Candace McNamee checking in for the Lady Diamonds. Jones on the drive, pass inside to Miller. Ball's deflected by Snyder, rebounded by Snyder. Coming up the floor to Dags. Dags with the shot, it's good. Nice job by Ashley coming to draw the defense and get rid of the basketball. have a foul here. On the Lady Diamonds. Whole new five coming in the ball game for the Lady Bulldogs. I'll tell you what, Jones deserves a rest. She's been all over the court here mm -hmm. in the second half. Phillips on the drive with the shot. It's off, rebounded by McNamee. Phillips is taking it in there with the towers in there, wasn't she? Yeah, she's only scared. about 5'3", probably. Pass inside to McNamee. Good job by McNamee. Keep the ball high. Shot's off, rebounded by Stoughton. Orozco with the ball. Lady Diamonds confused on defense. Stoughton with the drive inside in the bucket. Lady Diamonds looked confused defensively there. Gave up a layup. Knocked away by Roscoe and stolen. Wild pass here. Oh, she's passing to me. Yeah, I think you could have got that one. It's going to be out of bounds. It's going to be Lady Diamond basketball. 4.15 left here in the fourth quarter. Number 13, Heather McCauley in the ball game now for the Lady Diamonds. I think Dylan could have sank a shot from over here. I don't know. Have you seen him shoot? Yeah, that's why I'm saying that. I think he could. Sarah Snyder inside with the deuce. Good offensive execution by the Lady Diamonds. Shot on the way, three-pointer short. A little bit short. That was number 32. Lashley with the shot. Pass inside, nice pass. Lady Diamond's doing a good job executing the offense here, getting easy shots every time down the floor. We're gonna lay up every time down the floor. They're pretty much putting it away here. Gonna have a blocking foul here on Lindsey Daggs. Looks like Bowen checking back in the ball game for the Lady Bulldogs. Referee's confused here. 13 team fouls on the Lady Diamonds for some for some reason. Really haven't figured it out yet. There we go. Lady Bulldogs in the bonus. So 7-13. It's, it's 
close. Well, that's what they had. First shot's good. I just take what I'm given. Yeah. Do the best with it. Second shot for Stoughton on the way. It's off the back rim. Long rebound by Roscoe. Roscoe for three from the baseline off the front iron. Rebound inside by McNamee. Ball up the floor. Three minutes remaining in the ball game. And have a foul here, reaching foul. It's gonna be on Lashley. Lady Bulldogs fourth team foul. Hall on the drive, shot by Hall on the way. She's gonna be fouled, she's gonna go to the line, a blocking foul on the Lady Bulldogs. Two shots on the way for Hall. Had some problems hitting free throws tonight. Yeah, they have. Second shot's good. Three pointer on the way for Lashley. Excuse me, that's Fouts. Trap here. Lady Diamonds get out of it. Caitlin Hall off the floor. Drop off passes. Doesn't hit its target. It's going to be Lady Bulldog basketball. Second number three, Myra Salazar checking in the ball game for the Lady Diamonds. Also number 20, Megan Bartell. Good job by Sarah Snyder and Megan Smith tonight, getting them a, getting them a rest here during the ball game. Great job. Ball knocked away by Salazar, good hustle. Good job by the Lady Diamonds. McCauley up the floor with the lay -in. it's off, rebounded by Roscoe. Good defense there by Salazar. Yeah, good job. Phillips on the drive, stolen away by Salazar. Pass inside to McNamee, shot it off. Ball hits the head of a lady bulldog. It's gonna be out of bounds off the of Lady Diamonds. Like number 10, Sasha Rosen Hoover checking in the ball game for the Lady Diamonds. Bowen with the ball. A foul here on the floor. It looks like it's going to be on Bartell. It's going to send a Roscoe to the line. It's kind of look like a curveball. Yeah, kind of. I think it was a slider, actually. <laughs> it may have been. Salazar with the ball over to Ryzen Hoover. Ball's loose on the floor. Roscoe comes up with it. Up the floor to Phillips. Good hustle by Salazar. Good hustle by Bartell to get down the floor for the rebound. Good job by the Lady Diamonds. One minute remaining in the ball game. Ryzen Hoover with a shot from the baseline off the front iron. Rebound by Fouts. Gonna get a foul here. Looks like it's gonna be on Salazar. With 49.7 remaining, that's gonna send Bowen to the line, I believe. To shoot a one and one.
actually number three fouls at the line. Her shot's off. Looks like Cohen's in the ball game now for the Lady Diamonds. Number 22, Tiffany Cohen's in the ball game for the Lady Diamonds. Good to see her getting some action. Of course, her father, Charles Combs, longtime Diamondette customer. I think he may hold the bench press record for the city of South Salt, maybe. <laughs> he may well. <laughs> I don't think I could hold a candle against him. We're going to have a backcourt violation on Phillips here. Like number 30, Tara Johnson, also in the ball game from the Lady Diamonds. Let's see if the freshman gets played here in the last minute. What do you think, Clint? I don't know. Pass into Ryzen Hoover. Good ball handling there by Ryzen Hoover. Salazar behind the back. <laughs> Salazar's going to be a good one. Ryzen Hoover, 4 3, long rebound. Brought down by Roscoe. Rosen Hoover and Salazar, they'll get in there and play defense. Yeah, they will. They're pesky guards. They're both going to be some good ball players. Phillips with the shot from the top of the key. It's off. Rebounded by Bartell. Salazar up the floor. And that's the end of the ball game. Good game for the Lady Diamonds. Good win for them. Final score here, Salasaw, Lady Diamonds, 44, Spyro, Lady Bulldogs, 28. We'll be right back after a few words from our sponsors. about the death of a loved one is difficult, but it's vital that we have frank discussions about end-of-life care. I want all Americans to know that they can have hospice care at home, in a nursing home, or a hospital. And for most, the cost is covered by insurance, Medicare, or Medicaid. My mother recently turned 101, and we've made sure that her wishes will be respected. Discuss it with your family. You'll be thankful you did. Hello, can anybody hear me out there? Hey, Bob's not here right now, but if he was, I'm sure he'd be reminding you. Hello, I seem to have locked myself in my dressing room. And if you're in the market for a new or used car, truck, van, or SUV... A little help here. ...and you want the lowest possible price in that vehicle... Well, that's, oh, that's better. ...you need to come see us here at the home of the low price cars. That was the darndest thing. All right, uh, three, two, one. Hey! Blue Ribbon Salisaw, home of the low price cars. Well, what do you mean the commercial's already over? At Shelter, we offer great insurance, great performance, and great agents. That way, people can concentrate on the really important parts of life. So while you're doing things like this, we manage to do this. And if you ever do something like this, it's good to know this. At Shelter, we take care of things so you can get on with your life. For auto, home, life, or business insurance, see Shelter agent George Glenn. $30,000, do I hear 40? $40,000, 40, do I hear 50? 50, 50,000, I have 50,000. Sold to the gentleman in the side. Uh, hi. Moving on. This is yeah. a 19. Okay, I want to go ahead and sell it now. Sell what? Um, that thing I bought. Constantly buying and selling stocks doesn't make much sense either. That's why Edward Jones advises clients to buy long-term investments. Edward Jones, making sense of investing.
Bob Phoenix here for Blue Ribbon Salazar. Home of the low price cars rail. Hey, Bob, I just wanted to let you know that you're doing a really fantastic job. Well, thanks. I appreciate that. So anyway, as I was saying... When it comes to TV announcing, you're the top. I really appreciate that. Thank you very much. So like I was... Ooh, man, Bob. All right, all right. What's going on here? Hey, Bob. Hey, Bob. 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 Blue Ribbon Salazar. Home of the low price cars. Oh, there's some nice fellas there. My father spent his last teenage birthday in a rain of fire. I will not die here, he said to himself. Fifty years later, he whispered the same thing to me from the hospital bed. Hospice provides the end-of-life care you and your loved ones want and need. It's available to everyone. With the help of the people at our local hospice, he got his wish. And so did we. Hospice care. Comfort and compassion when it's needed most. Before you answer any questions about your insurance needs, doesn't it make sense to see the insurance company's report card first? Shelter insurance looks like this. We're rated A for excellent by AM Best. Here's more good news. Nine out of ten customers say they'd recommend us to someone else. An excellent rating and satisfied customers. Shelter insurance. You can save when you insure both your home and auto with Shelter. See Agent George Glenn for details. Hey, Bob. Yeah, have you disinfected the area? Good. Now make a three-inch incision between the fourth and fifth abdominal muscles. Shouldn't you be doing this? It's really straightforward. Listen, I gotta go, Bob. We'll talk to you later. Making important financial decisions on your own doesn't make much sense either. That's why Edward Jones prefers meeting clients face-to-face. -face. Edward Jones, making sense of investing. Thinking about the death of a loved one is difficult, but it's vital that we have frank discussions about end-of-life care. I want all Americans to know that they can have hospice care at home, in a nursing home, or a hospital. And for most, the cost is covered by insurance, Medicare, or Medicaid. My mother recently turned 101, and we've made sure that her wishes will be respected. Discuss it with your family. You'll be thankful you did. Hello, can anybody hear me out there? Hey, Bob's not here right now, but if he was, I'm sure he'd be reminding you. Hello, I seem to have locked myself in my dressing room. And if you're in the market for a new or used car, truck, van, or SUV... A little help here. ...and you want the lowest possible price in that vehicle... Well, that's, oh, that's better. ...you need to come see us here at the home of the low price cars. That was the darndest thing. All right, uh, three, two, one. Hey! Blue Ribbon Salazar, home of the low price cars. Well, what do you mean the commercial's already over? At Shelter, we offer great insurance, great performance, and great agents. That way, people can concentrate on the really important parts of life. So while you're doing things like this, we manage to do this. And if you ever do something like this, it's good to know this. At Shelter, we take care of things so you can get on with your life. For auto, home, life, or business insurance, see Shelter agent George Glenn. 